hi guys welcome back to another video welcome back if you are new here welcome back if you are a returning subscriber thank you for stopping by today it's a uh, i guess the second day since the kids went back to school two of my kids are in boarding school but one is uh, in day school so the two of them had gone and uh, i feel like i've got a setback because I had gotten used to them being around now, I feel like I'm not motivated and everything. So I've not been doing anything in the house. I've not been cleaning the utensils. I've not even washed the clothes. Now that the washing powder is over for the machine and the hand washing powder is also kind of over because it won't, it won't wash all the clothes that I have. So I'll today wash the clothes by hand using a bar soap and I'm bringing you along and I hope you enjoy this video and uh, this is the state of my kitchen as you can see that is how the kitchen looks like so much dirty utensils and uh, I don't feel guilty about that I only work when I feel like I'm really motivated to do it so today I'm going to take you along I'll be cleaning laundry i'll be cleaning uh, the utensils and uh, going back to my usual routine i don't know if you have kids that are going to boarding schools i don't know if you feel the same way let me know in the comment section okay this is the amount of laundry i'm supposed to tackle and because it's been more than five years since i washed this amount of laundry by hand i'll not wash all of it in fact, I've checked the washing powder container and I guess I can wash the kids' clothes in the washing machine. I normally do two, two cycles when the laundry basket is full to the top. But in this case, this is overflown. I will do three cycles. They say change is inevitable at times. And today this is the case. The machine washing powder is over and I have to work myself around the situation at hand and my solution is to wash some of the clothes by hand and the rest I can wash tomorrow or Saturday as I'm making this video today is Thursday. I always soak the clothes for one hour before washing even when I'm using the machine. The only different thing I'll do today is use warm water to soak the clothes. As the laundry is soaking, I'll be cleaning the utensils. That way I save on time now that I woke up late and I don't want to be late on picking the little one from school. I really love how the combination of soap and scouring powder cleans the sink. It leaves the sink shiny and super clean. I really love it. Something from nothing. Life lessons come one in a dozen. The other eleven is 
something from nothing. Life changes, just open the door. But one thing's certain, I'll always be yours. The time has arrived. I may don't know if I'll pull this through, but we move regardless. Whatever happens, happens. Ah, the clothes are perfectly soaked and that is easily cleanable. This won't take me long. I really was dreading the bending while cleaning for longer hours. The most important part of cleaning laundry for me is the rinsing part. If you don't rinse the clothes with enough water, be sure your clothes will have a pale color. Now, to avoid this, I normally rinse the clothes in three basins, as you see me do. I want my clothes to look the same even when they are old. Life lessons come one in a dozen. The other eleven give something from nothing. I sit here looking for an answer. Maybe the biggest question was in the last chapter. You gave me the soul I had today. Without you, I never could have moved away. But now we I'm done with the clothes and I feel like I still have some more energy and time to clean the shoes which I'll use brush and soap to clean. I also have shoes that don't require dipping in water and for those I'll just use a damp cloth to wipe that off. The rest I'll soak in the soapy water while I'm hanging the clothes outside. It's kind of funny that the more we pass time, the more we need to set them rewind. And 19 was the year I had to leave you, but now I'm seeing all the signs. Is this really happening? I can't believe it's true. I'm just as surprised as you. Is this really happening? I can't be too sure. But one day I'll be yours again. I also do the same thing with the shoes. I always use three waters, three waters of basins or basins of water, whatever, whichever. I usually use a lot of water to rinse out the rubber shoes, the canvas shoes. Because if you don't do that, it will show. It will show when the shoes dries out. It will really show. I have also decided to clean these uh, doormats. They were so dirty. Oh, the level of dirt that was in these things. But it is life. It's life. Can you imagine I made this? I made this with my own hands. The beauty of staying at home. You become creative. 29 and I find myself wondering What did happen to the last 10? Ran away with my life fast forward Never turn back again Look at how beautiful the sun is shining I really love the sun I love summer I also love when the rains are here But I really love when the sun is out Because I'm able to To dry the clothes faster so this is where I am drying, I'm, I'm going to dry the mats, the door mats and the shoes and they'll get dry a lot quicker. Thank you for stopping by. 
thank you for being with me till this time of the video see you in the next video and bye